Learning doesn't have to be boring. In fact, the Netflix show Emily's Wonder Lab is making science fun for the kids. And here to tell us more about the kid-approved show is child acting sensation and fellow science experimenter Mason Wells. Hey, Mason, thanks so much for joining us. Can you tell us when you started acting? Well, I started acting when I was six. I started acting like it was fun. I didn't know what I was doing. And it was so much fun, so I started doing more and more until I came to here. Okay, so you said you started when you were six, but how old are you now? Nine. You're nine. Okay, so you have three years under your belt. What was the audition process like for getting onto Emily's Wonder Lab? So the audition process was like is that you had to go do the audition, and in the audition they told me, hey, Mason, can you tell us something about why you like science, and why it's so much fun for you, and do you like getting messy? And I said, I love science because it's fun, it's exciting, you get to do experiments, and yes, I love getting messy. Yeah, every little boy probably does. So they cast you on the show, and it's called Emily's Wonder Lab. So what's the show all about? The show's about to show young kids, specifically girls, that they can be scientists, engineers, they can make so many experiments. And the show was just to motivate kids to be in the scientific world. How fun, I'm looking at some of the pictures and stuff from the show. So you said you liked science even before you got on the show. Um, do you have a favorite yep. memory or something funny you can tell us from the filming? At the filming was so much fun. So here's something funny that happened. So there were real ostrich eggs on set, and they, one cracked, so we had to use the other. And one <laughs> other thing that's super cool is that I got to walk on eggs. Thousands and thousands of eggs. Oh. And so much fun because you had to figure out a way to walk across without cracking eggs. I feel like I cracked 12 eggs. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess I guess that's a good thing. Now, you're going to do a little experiment for us, right? Yes. Okay, so let's get it started. So the experiment we're going to do is Ooglat from episode two. So what you'll need, one part water and two parts cornstarch and some food coloring to make it colorful. First, add your food coloring to your water. Add two drops, and now you're ready to mix both. Add your cornstarch okay. and your water. Now, mix with your hands. Oh my goodness, so you're getting your hands dirty. So that was part of the show, is to get dirty. Yep, so a non fluid is a fluid that doesn't abide by normal fluid rules, which means it sometimes acts like a solid and it sometimes acts like a liquid. Oh. You can actually see this when I bounce it back and forth like a ball. Now what and is this called I... again that you're making? It's very slimy. Yeah, it's actually a slime, but it's actually called ooga. Okay. And if I get a ball out of here, <laughs> if I bounce it back and forth, it acts like a solid. But then as soon as I stop, it starts acting oh, like a Oh, wow. That's pretty, that's very interesting. You know, you, you seem like a scientist already to me. Um, you said, you know, the show's kind of geared toward getting girls into science, but obviously boys can do it too. Um, yep. And we can watch it on Netflix. Who do you think needs to watch your show? Everybody, like adults, teenagers, kids, every age group is fine, even 108. Yeah, no, that's pretty cool. I want to thank you for coming on the show and sharing that with us. And can you do that little thing again, tossing it back and forth? Sure. Let me get a ball. Yeah. Thing. So that's solid. And then liquid. liquid. Mason, I have learned something new. I'm going to have to tune in so I can catch more of these experiments. And you can watch Mason as well. All you have to do is check out Netflix, Emily's Wonder Lab, and you'll see all these fun science experiments on the show.